it's your girl Maya Chanel. Welcome back to the channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and turn the post notification bells on, baby. So today we are reviewing these brand new, brand spanking new Tree Hunt facial scrubs. Y'all heard it. Not the body scrubs, the facial scrubs. Cause I know a lot of y'all been asking me, can I use this on my face? Can I use this as a facial scrub? Can I get my face to be glowing, glowing? Ding, ding. Um, they've answered your prayers, okay? They got the facial scrubs and they got four different kinds. Well, at least that's the, the ones that I saw, but I got them all so that we can get the scents, get the feel, get the texture, all of that. So. Y'all go ahead and like this video right now because we're about to get into it, okay? First things first. They have this banana oat. Um, Aha is the flavor. I mean the scent. So this is moisturizing sugar face scrub. Now all of these do something different. So I'm, I'm assuming you need all of them. Because this one is the moisturizing one. So the banana, the banana oat is the moisturizing one now. I don't know how I feel about the banana on the face, but we're gonna figure this out now. Um, all of these facial scrubs are cruelty free and vegan and made with 100% natural exfoliate. So, you know, they're trying to be, con um, I guess, nature conscious or, I don't know. Y'all know what I'm trying to say, though. But, um, so this one is supposed to soothe, cleanse pores, and smooth out your skin. Um, all of them do something different. Like I said, this is because this one is moisturizing and soothing, I'm assuming. So they said that on the back, they tell you what it's for. Um, soothes, hydrates, and smooths tired-looking skin to reveal a refreshed, radiant complexion. Alpha hydroxy acid and 100% real sugar deep clean pores um, to remove dull dead skin and impurities. Banana helps to hydrate and smooth while oat helps to smooth, I mean soothe and calm skin for a healthy looking glow. So if that's what you need, baby, there you go. Okay, you, you got it right there. That's what it does for you. So the banana helps to um, smooth out your skin. Okay. Um, let's get into the scent of this one. Now these come in 7.4 ounce tubes, which is a good decent amount, I would assume. Now, this is this is not bad. It kind of reminds me of like the banana now laters, now laters, and pop a pop an image here if y'all don't never if I'm dating my age. Um pop an image right there for you, okay? But in comparison to the body scrubs, the scent is much lighter. And I'm assuming that's because you don't want to have too much fragrance going on on your face. So the scent is way, way lighter. But it's not bad. It's not bad. Hmm. Okay. So that is the banana oat. If you need moisture, smoothness, soothness, all of that, get this one. Next one. This one is the watermelon cactus, watermelon cactus water, aha. Okay, this one is supposed to be hydrating. So we had the moisturizing, now we got the hydrating. And this one is supposed to be a hydrator, cleanser, and a smoother. So it says hydrates, illuminates, and smooths tired looking skin. Why it always gotta be tired looking skin? Why it just can't be like me just trying to upkeep or whatever, you know what I mean? To reveal a refreshed, radiant complexion, alpha hydroxy acid, and 100% real sugar deep cleans pores to remove dull, dead skin and impurities. Watermelon and cactus water help quench dry skin with the natural boost of moisture for a healthy looking glow. You learn something new every day. Who knew? Well, I guess that's why they in a the desert. They gotta quench something, you know, hold something for us to drink if we out there getting stuck. But if you need some hydration, baby, now, what's the difference between moisture and hydration? Maybe I should pop the definitions right here. Moisture, hydration. Okay, so we get that. But um, if you need moisture, banana. Get like more smoothness to your skin. And then if you need hydration, watermelon and cactus water. Okay, two down, two to go. 
Now the next one that we have is the blueberry turmeric and this one is supposedly purifying, okay? Supposedly purifying for the skin, blueberry turmeric. Now turmeric we know is definitely really good for um, evening out your skin tone. So I'm assuming that this one does that as well. And like I said, all these are cruelty free and vegan, which we know we love. We love and um, things that are like, you know, not causing harm to any living creatures or animals or anyone. <laughs> And it's also using natural products, so very vegan free. Um, let's see, this one purifies, purifies, cleanses, pores, and smooths your skin. So this one, let's see what the blueberry does because the first thing is always the same. Um, always talking about we got tired skin or whatever. Um, blueberry and turmeric help draw out impurities and provide boosting antioxidants for healthy looking glow. Okay, so if he needs to cleanse the pores, get those blackheads out of there, get any bacteria out of there, and get any build up, you know, cause we build up oils and, you know, our lotions build up in our pores, our makeup builds up in our pores. So if we need to extract blueberry turmeric, baby, blueberry turmeric. Next, last but not least, we have the pineapple papaya, which is supposed to be brightening, brightening for your face, okay? So this one, everyone wants to look radiant, okay? Glow, baby, glow. Let your soul glow. <laughs> but so this one is supposed to brighten. So the pineapple and papaya, papaya contain natural enzymes and vitamin C known to help skin achieve a healthy looking glow so yeah definitely vitamin c is key don't mind my nails y'all vitamin c is key to having the glowy the, the glowy key glow. okay uh, okay i'm doing the most i'm doing the most anyways so this one is supposed to help brighten and tone your skin now i know i smelled the first one let me go ahead and smell these others as well honestly it's kind of like they all smell the same for some reason like hold on because those two both smell the like i can smell watermelon in this one for sure okay but like i said all of them are like very faint smells so this one had definitely I smell that pineapple and the papaya but they're all very faint so um let me actually see how much fragrance they put in here okay so the next step that I want to do is go ahead and I know sometimes these scrubs have different textures they have different feels and all of that so I want to go ahead and like test them on my skin so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put just a dab Honestly, just a dab and see how it feels. So, all right, y'all. So, as you can see, here is the banana oat. Here is the pineapple papaya. This is the blueberry turmeric. And this is the watermelon cactus water. So, if you can see, obviously, they're very thick. Um, not, they're a little less thick than the scrub, obviously. As you can see, like, one of them is, like, running down my hand right now. But, they're definitely not as watery as a lot of different things, which is good because it means that it's, you know, going to hydrate and do what it needs to do and not be running all over the place. Now, let's kind of fill out these textures. So, if I, okay, hmm, okay. If I'm feeling, all of them kind of feel alike, to be honest. But this one, okay, obviously, like, the sugar crystals melt as you move them. They honestly feel, honestly feel all, all of them feel alike, to be honest, in my opinion. Now, if I'm going to, I'm just going to kind of mix them together. All right, so it feels pretty nice pretty smooth um i mean i know that they say a lot of different things about like scrubs and stuff 
To me, in my opinion, I would probably want a more gentle scrub. It's not to say that it's not good or anything, but I see where it could possibly end up being a little rough or abrasive, especially for more sensitive skin, just because the sugar crystals are a bit large. Um, but nonetheless, I'm going to rinse this off with warm water just so we can see how it feels after I've gently massaged it onto my hand. All right, so I've washed it off. You can see my hand here and it feels pretty nice, pretty, um, I mean, hydrated, purified. I, I mixed them all in there. So it's, it better be doing everything. And I mean, it's obviously not gonna be like that on the first attempt. So um, yeah, this is my honest review. I am not sure that I would use this on my face just because, you know, those micro tears in your skin, I feel like it could possibly do that. But, you know, it depends on the person, how your skin type is. I have very sensitive skin. So for me, it's not something that I would necessarily use. But for someone who may need, um, may have a lot of acne and may want to get rid of different blackheads and different things like that and purify their skin, and give it a, a very nice smooth finish. I think this could possibly help someone else out like that. Um, but other than that, if you guys have tried these products, I got them at Ulta if you're looking for them online. That was the only place I was able to get them was online at Ulta. And if you guys try them out, let me know how you like them. If you have already tried them out, let me know in the comments below. Make sure you like this video. And until next time, I will see you guys on the next video. Let me know what other things you'd like for me to review for you. And until next time, it's your girl, Maya Chanel. I'm going to see y'all in the next video.